Hello everyone, in this tutorial for using the LBE Desktop Help Desk software, what we will be doing is writing a new solution into a knowledge base. Now as you recall, a knowledge base is simply just a system that organizes information so it's easily searchable and browsable for technicians and help desk operators in the future when looking for related topics to current issues they're working on. So you can kind of think of the knowledge base as kind of like a library uh, with the accessibility of an online resource and the freedom of a hosted solution instead of just a bunch of headaches trying to look for randomness. Not only is the knowledge base a good tool for technicians, it's also a good tool to be able to present users with as a quick self-help reference to answer questions to frequently asked questions. And in most help desk software you have the opportunity or the ability to show some of your knowledge base articles while hiding others just for your support staff. So let's take a look at how to do that now in the LB desktop help desk software. Very simple, you just expand your help desk jobs, go down to knowledge base, click that, you'll see that opens up. We don't have any knowledge base articles here. If we want to add one, we simply click on the new knowledge base item. And you can see we have problem and solution here. So we'll simply enter some information in here so that we can create a new knowledge base entry. Let's take a look at this recent help desk call and we'll just kind of see how you can gather some information here. Now this information has given the caller to give some information to the technician as well as the technician is walking them through some steps. What's pretty good because now we can take that and create a knowledge base article in our LBE help desk software to capture steps that were followed to share them with other agents that want to, might experience the same issue later on they can easily go to this knowledge base article and not have to recreate all the steps. Here's the second half of that entry. So now you can take a look at that and then pull some of those details and go in and create your knowledge base article. Let's just give this a simple title. We will just call this how to resolve the issue for a customer when their PC is frozen up. So we'll just modify that a little bit and we'll go tab down to the solution area and we'll put our steps in. Okay, now that you have a solution entered in as a sequence of steps to follow for the technician and as well as the customer, you have your knowledge base entry created. So go ahead and hit OK and you will now see that you have your knowledge base article. If you need to go back in and fix anything in this, you can always double click on it to bring up the entire entry. Now of course as you have completed this, if you needed to provide let's say provide a printed version or a HTML document to your customer of this knowledge base article you could do so and just let them have that as a reference if needed or if you're creating a uh, help desk technician book for your easy reference at your desk you can do that as in the IT world we don't really like to have a lot of paper laying around so obviously a digital copy is what's preferred but if I wanted, I could go up to in here in my LB desktop help desk software and hit file, export. We just want to do this record here. Let's just put this on our desktop. And we will just call this web 6, or we can just call it knowledge base. HTML. We'll hit open. We'll make sure HTML is selected here. We'll hit OK. Now we'll go ahead and open up that file and see how it looks in our browser. I'll go ahead and click that now. And you can see we have a HTML document open here with the problem and solution if we needed to uh, put that on our uh, server or if we were, you know, wanted to maybe save that and do a screenshot sent to a customer. Whatever the case would be, we now have a digital copy to be able to share. 
Well, that's it for creating a knowledge base article here in our LBE help desktop help desk software.